I'd love to invite you to our live two-week intensive dome home workshop in Nepal where we are going to learn how to construct two types of dome homes as well as a constructed wetland which will treat all the grey water from your bath and shower. The one structure is a super adobe home with barbed wire reinforcement on every single coil. It is so strong that I actually don't get a Wi-Fi signal inside my Super Adobe Dome. And the other structure is an Aircrete Dome, all based on sacred geometrical proportions for the foundation. So we're actually going to make our own Aircrete bricks using a foaming agent and a little bit of cement. This will be all mixed up and pour it into forms and then we'll cut them up just like a giant cake and stack the bricks using a compass arm. So I'm going to teach you how to build foundation, how to create the bricks, how to stomp the sandbags, how to insert the windows, how to build around the windows. There's some tricky eyebrow situations there on a the sandbag dome so we'll actually go with larger bags around the eyebrow and eave it's called and create an awning which will stop the water from coming into your window and then as we get to the high levels it gets quite tricky because the bricks have to be actually shaped and the sandbags also have to be stomped in the very specific ways because the core building in quite a bit and unless done properly they can actually fall right in sitting in the super adobe structure it is such a cozy room it's like a mother's womb i'm actually sleeping there every night now i have recorded on video training and you will have the detailed step-by-step -step practical video training material in order for you to complete the entire house to the state that it's standing in right now including the wooden floor including the slab even including the underground water tank the skylight installation and a finishing painting work including some awesome effects. I'll show you how I dip the half brush in one color, another half in another color to get that darker feel around the edges. So come along to our live training where we're going to learn two types of dome homes, Super Adobe as well as an Aircrete. We will build a constructed wetland and with any free spare time, we're gonna hammer on to our outdoor bath. So you're gonna get to learn and experience what it is to build your own home and of course everything that we do not get done you will have in video training you see i've traveled the world and i learned from top ecological masters such as mike reynolds jeff lawton john todd john jevons ibrahim karim from my geometry and many many more and when i came back to our site this experimental site in johannesburg south africa i've actually built and experimented with every single eco-technological feature that I have learned. So I've built a biochar filtration and a ferro cement tank. The story goes on. You can watch the video on our abundance of water course. And I've recorded two courses, the Living Eco Dome Home Masterclass and the Abundance of Water Masterclass. So as a gift to all our live students, I will be providing you with our full comprehensive Living Eco Home Masterclass, where you're going to learn how to take this shell with the waterproofing the black stuff on the edges here and full painting plastering flooring skylight installation electrical installation door manufacturing and much more so this course will actually give you all the tools you need to complete the home to the level that you're seeing right behind me so i look forward to be seeing you at our two-week live training workshop where we're going to build this beautiful dome home together. I'm going to have, I'm going to find it difficult to put in words because um, it's that high, really. I'm, uh, my emotions are going since I'm here. Uh, the human experience is just absolutely great. Um, the exchange, the fact that we're coming from all over the world, the fact that we don't know each other and everything is going so fluidly and uh, the energy is going up and it, for me it's much more and I think for all of us it's much more than just building houses we're kind of creating now uh, the world we're dreaming of I could nearly cry <laughs> it's that important really 
voilà, I'm loving every second of it. Ouais, thanks à Losha. Now I feel confident and capable to build one of these structures myself. Um, so yeah, thank you. And also just the, all the awesome people that we've met and been able to network with around us from all over the world, all walks of life. Um, that's been an amazing experience and thank you very much for allowing that to happen. It's been very interesting in terms of being it new, being it fresh. No one's doing this. This is the first of its kind here and the first of its kind in the world in terms of the merging of the technologies. It's new, it's fresh, there's a lot of research and development which happens to be perfect for really getting down to it and knowing what we are making and uh, refining it, honing it and having the opportunity which quite frankly once it's perfected you don't have any more so yeah grateful for this opportunity to explore and actually work things out and think for myself what can i say here i am building a home using power tools flinging mud concrete working with wood all sorts of things i've never done my whole life um, which is amazing uh, amazing experience for me growing and having now the confidence to go and maybe build myself a little structure in terms of how the course has been presented um, I've had a great time I've been learning a lot Alosha is very very knowledgeable about a lot of different things beautiful energy great to work with them um, and he's attracted all these amazing people into this workshop which I've made new friends, um, connected with people in many different ways and I know that these people will be a part of my life going forward. Um, we're really fortunate to be able to run the course here at uh, this Nepali Gardens farm. Uh, it's a really nice example of biodiversity. There's over 200 species of plants growing here. Um, lots of them used for the Nepali Gardens tea, um, for Ayurvedic purposes and, and other things. And the farm is a, a real working farm and it's in the rural countryside, a beautiful location. We have great Nepali workers here we're making friends with, learning some Nepali words, learning some Nepali cooking and learning a lot about the culture as well. Well, in addition to being in the classroom and learning there and doing lots of hands-on activities, we also have a good time at the course. A lot of nights we'll have either a movie night or a fire where people get together and tell stories and sing songs and just share and, and kind of relax together as well. Until then, have a fantastic day.